Uh, welcome back my dear friends and uh, students in another video lecture. Uh, today uh, we are discussing one important numerical uh, which was asked in J.K. Moore's uh, 2019 paper. Uh, the numerical was based on a uh, more concept. Okay, now let us see uh, what that numerical was. Uh, the question was like this. Uh, calculate number of moles, molecules and neutrons in 49 gram of sulfuric acid, right? So, we have a weight of sulfuric acid, that is 49 gram. We have 49 gram of sulfuric acid. We have to see how many moles, how many molecules and how many neutrons. So, we can take protons. We will not take questions about protons. We will take protons. We will take protons. We will take protons. We will take protons. Okay, what do we do? We will use the whole concept. Now we will see the solution of this problem. If you will talk of number of moles, how do we use the number of moles? We will use the simple formula. We will not do anything. Number of moles. Okay, we will use the number of moles. That I will represent that by small n. We will use the number of moles. We will use the given mass upon molar mass. Given mass upon molecular mass. So I will write here, given mass. upon molecular mass yeah i will say uh, molar mass uh, so given mass uh, it is given here that is 49 gram right of sulfuric acid so i will write here 49 uh, divided by molar masses uh, now you have to calculate the molar mass of sulfuric acid right so how you can calculate okay now i will uh, calculate the molar mass of Sulfuric acid, uh, you know uh, this how to calculate that. Uh, we have sulfuric acid that is H2SO4. Right? So, what I will do is uh, first, you know, uh, first I will, you know, write uh, the atomic, you know, uh, the atomic mass of hydrogen that is 1U, 1 unified mass, uh, but here we have two atoms of hydrogen. So, I will write here 2 into 1, and you have to simply uh, add up the atomic masses of the individual elements. Uh, plus uh, uh, for sulfur, uh, if I will uh, talk of sulfur, the atomic mass of sulfur that is 32 U, 32 unified mass. Then plus, uh, you know, uh, then we have four, uh, you know, oxygen atoms, right? So I will write uh, multiply. Um, I will write four into, you know, the atomic mass of one uh, oxygen that is 16 U, right? That is uh, simply 16 U. So I will write here 16. So simply, what you will get is two, two into one that is two, plus then 32. So this is simply 64, right? So uh, this is simply, you know, uh, 64, right? So simply uh, you are, you know, uh, molar mass uh, of sulfuric acid, that is simply what? 98, right? Now uh, if you are 2 plus 32 plus 64, that is simply 98. Uh, so you will get 98 gram per mole. So what I will use, I will simply use uh, this, uh, you know, I will in place of molar mass of sulfuric acid. So this was given mass was 49 gram, right? And uh, then uh, I have to divide by molar mass of sulfuric acid that I have calculated that is 98 gram per mole. I'm getting so simply uh, you are so simply here uh, you know this gram and gram it will uh, cancel out, and so what we will get is so simply uh, your n uh, becomes equal to that is so uh, you are uh, simply n uh, becomes equal to 0.5, right? Right? That is 1 by 2, that is 0 0.5, 0 0.5 mole. So now uh, you have calculated the first part of question. First, you have calculated the number of moles, right? 49 grams of sulfuric acid, we have 0.5 moles, right? Okay, uh, now uh, what we have to uh, do next, we have to calculate also the number of molecules, right? Uh, so, better kya karne, khali aapko mole, according to mole concept, aapko formulas use karne mole concept. So uh, now I have to calculate the number of molecules. And how uh, and you know how to calculate the number of molecules? That is simply number of moles into Avogadro's number. That any so simply uh, I have calculated the number of moles. That's 0.5 mole. 0.5 mole into Avogadro's number, right? That is 6.022. 6.022 into 10 to the power 23, right? Uh, so you know. Uh, so upon uh, solving the echo equation 0.5 into 6.022 uh, that is simply uh, equal to 3.01 into 10 to the power 23 right so here uh, we have calculated the number of molecules right in 49 grams of sulfuric acid now what we have to do is 
Uh, now we have to calculate the number of uh, neutrons, right? Uh, first we will see about how many uh, protons will be there to put in gram of sulfuric acid. It can also be asked, right? So I will uh, write here. So I will write here number of moles of number of moles of protons number of protons in 98 gram of sulfuric acid right simply what you have to do is you have to simply uh, take the uh, you know proton number of the individual atoms you know uh, we have uh, you know, uh, two hydrogen atoms in sulfuric acid so two in you know uh, this hydrogen has atomic number one so it uh, means uh, number of protons in hydrogen atom that would be one plus then uh, sulfur that atomic number of sulfur is 16 uh, so it means uh, it contains uh, 16 number of protons plus then we have four uh, you know atoms of oxygen multiply by oxygen uh, you know uh, atomic number of oxygen is eight right so it means uh, it contains how many protons eight protons right Uh, so upon uh, solving this, uh, you will uh, simply get uh, that is 50 moles, right? So uh, what I had done, I had uh, calculated the number of moles of proton, right? In 98 gram of sulfur. You know, but the given mass of sulfur is, is not 98, right? It is how much? It is 49, right? So I will calculate uh, uh, number of moles of protons in 49 gram of sulfuric acid, simply. So I uh, know uh, number of moles of protons, right? In 49 grams. Because 49 gram of sulfur given uh, mass of sulfuric acid that is given, that calculated 49 grams of sulfuric acid. So, beta, ये तो आपको simply है. अगर 98 grams of sulfuric acid में 50 moles होंगे ना, तो इसका हम 98 के बजाय 49 लेते हैं. हम जो weight लेते हैं sulfuric acid का वो हम हम बिल्कुल half लेते हैं ना. लेते हैं ना 50 percent. तो इसका भी half हो जाएगा. 50 moles का भी half हो जाएगा. That is simply 50 divided by 2. Right? That is simply 25 moles. तो अगर 40 अगर 98 ग्राम सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड में 50 मोल्स होंगे है ना 50 मोल्स प्रोटॉन्स के होंगे तो 49 ग्राम में सिंपली 25 मोल्स होंगे अब हम क्या करेंगे अब हम हमें नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन्स निकालने हैं ना सिंपली हम ऐसे ही नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन्स कितने निकालेंगे कैसे निकालेंगे नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन्स हम लिखेंगे नंबर ऑफ मोल्स सो आई राइट हियर यू नो नंबर ऑफ मोल्स ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन्स पहले हम न्यूट्रॉन्स देखेंगे कितने ग्राम में शवर वैसे ही करेंगे ये 98 ग्राम ऑफ इन 98 ग्राम ऑफ Sulfuric acid, right? Okay, uh, so how to calculate you, you know number of neutrons? That is simply mass number, mass number minus atomic number. That is uh, number of protons. If we had calculated number of protons, right? Uh, so uh, you know mass number of sulfuric acid that is 98 minus number of protons. Number of protons uh, we had calculated that is 50 moles, right? That is simply minus 50. Uh, that is simply equal to 48 moles, right? Now we have calculated the number of neutrons in 98 gram of sulfuric acid. But we have the number of neutrons in 49 gram. So what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Simply divide by 2. How many moles are in 98 gram of sulfuric acid? If we have the number of neutrons in 98 gram of sulfuric acid, तो क्या करेंगे शब्द मगर हमें क्या करना है हमें नंबर न्यूट्रॉन निकालें 49 ग्राम सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड तो वो इसका होगा ना ऑफ तो सिंपली व्हाट आई विल इज नाउ आई विल कैलकुलेट द नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन्स इन 49 49 ग्राम ऑफ सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड आई सो so that will be 48 by 2. So this is simply 20. Uh, so it is you know simply 24 mole, right? Uh, so you know in this question we had calculated the number of moles, number of molecules, number of protons, and number of neutrons in 49 gram of sulfuric acid. I uh, hope uh, you got a distribution of this question. Thank you for watching this video.